Am I the asshole for coming out as a lesbian immediately after publicly separating from my husband? My ex and I didn't have a great relationship and I was also questioning my sexuality for about a year before I decided to end it for other reasons edit. He was petty, childish, inconsiderate of my feelings, and decided if he had a bad day I had to have a bad day too. Shortly after we told our families and friends we were calling it quits, I also came to the conclusion that I'm a lesbian and I publicly came out for the end of Pride Month. My ex is really upset about this and thinks I should have waited a while, because now people will think he turned me into a lesbian. Apparently his friends have been making fun of him for it. Am I the asshole? Not the asshole, you get to decide when you come out. And, turning someone into a lesbian, is ridiculous. That said, while it's nobody's business, people do talk. Coming out immediately post-divorce is going to cause a lot of assumptions about your marriage and why it ended. NTA and if men could turn women into lesbians there would be way more lesbians in the world. And the other way around. With that logic all those middle-aged men in the trope of oh my ball and chain wife is such a nag, she actually wants me to talk to her but she's so dense ah ha ha would also be gay. Nah. You are of course free to live your life however. I struggled on NAH because your ex could be somewhat of an idiot here based on the turned you into a lesbian shit. However, a divorce is a traumatic time, and he may feel some kind of way about having been with someone who wasn't sexually interested in him, and taking flack from homophobic assholes. You don't owe him a talk over a cup of coffee, but it couldn't hurt. He needs some direction, e.g. to be told his friends are fucking idiots and not very good friends. You. No. Your ex, MMMMM maybe. Depending, not enough info. His friends. These. These are the rectums, the anal orifices because they have gone beyond, you don't get it, and are well into how stupid are you. I didn't explore my sexuality until my ex asked me to, also not the reason he's my ex, granted he took it better, but, no, not the asshole. I mean, you could have waited a bit longer. And for those who are saying you don't wake up gay, you're right, but some of us were raised in a heteronormative culture where even the thought of exploration of sexuality was frowned upon, and until much later in life we didn't even consider that our feelings for women could be more than just platonic. It takes some is a lot longer to figure out why guys don't do it for us, I was 36. Nah, these things happen. It is not like you had a party and announced it without telling him before divorce was in the picture. Nah. You deserve to life your life and shouldn't have to lie for anyone, but it's understandable that your ex has some feelings about it. Sounds like his friends are the asshole here. No assholes here there is nothing wrong with you coming out. However, you're getting divorced and, as a divorce lawyer, I know that feelings will be high on both sides and no wonder he feels a bit upset about it. No doubt this also makes him question many aspects of your marriage previously to, did she ever really love me? Was she just pretending to find me attractive? etc., which is a hard thing for anyone. While his feelings aren't correct it doesn't make him an asshole for feeling that way. It is understandable that he feels hurt, especially if his friends are being dickheads to him about it. He will come around in due course. Nah, you divorced him and then immediately came out. You can't blame him for being hurt and thinking irrationally. Honestly from his perspective you probably lied and betrayed him as well, and you can't blame him for that at all. Not the asshole. He can't turn somebody into a lesbian. It's just how and who you are. Sometimes it takes a long time to figure it out. Relax about it. It's all right. Not the asshole my ex came out as gay a month after he ended the relationship. Nobody ever thought that I was the cause for his sexuality. Not the asshole. You coming out is about you, not him. Info are you still on good terms with your ex? Was it an amicable divorce? If so, and if you haven't had one already, and you're comfortable with it, now may be a good time for a conversation with him about what your side was like, e.g. when you suspected you were attracted to women, it had nothing to do with him, etc., he's bound to be feeling some things. If it was bad, messy, he may be lashing out. It sounds to me like him telling you that his friends are giving him a bad time about how he turned his wife into a lesbian might be his own worry too. He is not your responsibility, you're not married to him, but this may be where he's coming from, obviously, I don't know him like you do, so I could be way off base. I'm leaning toward NAH unless there are other mitigating factors. Not the asshole, even if you came out a year after your divorce, his friends would still make the same comments as he was your last male partner. Say hello to Ross. 
on a more serious note not the asshole. Na imagine getting divorced from your wife because she was gay. He will not hear the end of it and will get kicked when already down. Not the asshole, it's interesting that he's making your sexuality about about him. Very telling. Glad you got out. Not the asshole, and I'd also say your ex's friends aren't friends, they are idiots. Nah, this is pretty common. And a divorce is already very hard on people and this news is just an extra layer and dimension that he has to process. For many men, much of their identity is tied up on sexual prowess etc., just like for many women it might be motherhood or beauty. Coming out as gay can certainly attack that for him or his social circle. So now he has to deal with feelings of contributing to a failed marriage, and now reconcile how he managed to turn his wife gay, which is it the case, but quite a few people will think that. While I think nothing wrong of what you did, I believe if you can provide him with some empathy and a chance to talk to him about how he feels about it could go a long way. I personally would have spent a lot of time leading up to when I thought I'd announce by getting his input, which would have given him a few weeks to process and formulate how he wants to address it if his friends or family ask him about it. Not the asshole. I went back and forth between no assholes here and not the asshole but it sounds like your husband's issue isn't really your timing but that he's basically blaming you for his friends being assholes which makes him an asshole. NTA that's just life gotta live yours the people that are assholes are his friends. Not the asshole. Your coming out is about you, not your ex. Jury's out on your ex, but his friends are the true Oz here. I mean, I get that you coming out is about you, but the divorce is about you both, and the timing was such that it could look a certain way on him to others. Whether those others are ignorant or have the wrong idea doesn't really matter if your husband feels he must respond to them and or cares what those people think. If you thought your announcement wouldn't impact him in any way, that was short-sighted of you and frankly kind of insensitive. I feel like you could have tried to be cognizant of the probability that he'd be feeling raw and upended from being handed divorce papers and taken that into account. While I get that you're feeling happy and empowered about starting a new life, personally I think you broke this news a little too soon. So I'm not saying this vehemently, but I think you are the asshole. At least more than he is. Congratulations on coming out. Not the asshole. Your ex's friends are the asshole because it, they should be supporting him rather than treating this as a joke and be they're being homophobic and sexist by even implying that a man can turn a woman gay. Your husband is being unfair by placing the blame on you but I'm guessing he needs people in his corner right now and needs to see his friends in a positive light. Not the asshole but his friends are. He is a little bit for being upset with you. Mostly the biggest stars are his friends who sound like homophobes. Not the asshole. And his friend would be making fun of him even if you came out a year later. Not the asshole, not your problem. And hash x200b. Edit, and you can't turn someone lesbian, JFC. Not the asshole, the asshole here is your ex-husband's friends making him feel insecure over something that is not about him at all. You don't realize your sexuality from lack of attraction, you realize it because of a strong attraction to another gender. I also want to put this out there, r late Bloomberg lesbians is a great subreddit filled with women who have had similar experiences to you. Not the asshole, if the excuse is that he turned you into a lesbian, then his buddies are working hard to turn more women into lesbians with their asshat behavior I guess lol. Not the asshole. I dated a gay guy, I'm a woman, for three years. I broke up with him for unrelated reasons, and shortly after we broke up, he came out. I definitely did get some unnecessary comments about how I turned him gay. I imagined those comments would be even more prevalent since you two were married, but at no point did I feel like I should challenge his timing on coming out. I just told those people that I was happy that I helped him realize who he was, his words originally, not mine, and that I wished him well. So yeah, I get that he may be catching some hell, but that's still not an excuse for trying to control you. Not the asshole you can't turn someone lesbian for one, so his own homophobia is his own issue. Two is was likely part of your journey of coming to terms with the way your life was unfolding. Edit, part of your journey meaning the right time to publicly declare and validate who you are. Not the asshole. So you're responsible for people not knowing that sexuality is how you were born? They're assholes. Don't let anyone bully you. Congratulations for coming out. I also didn't realize I like women until later in life.
that doesn't mean I became anything, it means I realized who I was and especially after being indoctrinated into heterosexual society. I was in a similar situation, my girlfriend of two years came out as a lesbian about two weeks after we broke up. I was a little upset that she'd moved on so quickly, but mostly I was supportive of it, it was her choice. However, the amount of jokes and jeers I get from friends and family members can still be really upsetting, even though it's been nearly a year. I'm not excusing any of your ex's behavior, nor am I calling you the asshole, it's your choice, and it's on him to support you, or at least be amicable. It sounds like you gave him enough time. But the comments will really be hurting him, and he can't argue with friends and family for fear of looking or seeming weak. Naturally he blames you, which is an unfortunate but understandable consequence. Not the asshole, but circumstances will make this hard on him. I'm straight but I feel like the expression of your sexuality is not something that should be dictated by others' convenience. Anyway, your ex should appreciate having this as a plausible reason why your marriage didn't work out. No assholes hear your sexuality, your coming out, your decision. His friends are the asshole for mocking him and claiming someone can turn you into a lesbian. That's just subtle homophobia. That said, I understand why he's hurt. He's being repeatedly embarrassed and ridiculed. So I can't really call him the asshole either. Not the asshole. This is ridiculous. Nobody can turn you into a lesbian. Not the asshole. Twitter.com slash NBC Brooklyn 99 slash status slash 11827794005986385923892 question mark lang equals n. N-A-H-H. The only assholes here are his friends. And him if he's being a dick about it. Dot. I'd much rather people thought I got divorced because my spouse realized they were straight, gay than because I'm a shitty spouse. Poor Ross. Not the asshole. He's either got some ignorant asshole friends, which isn't your responsibility to mitigate, or his friends are just joking and he needs to take himself less seriously, which is also not your problem to fix. Why do I get the feeling that one of the things that broke your marriage was him sitting back and expecting you to fix anything he complained about? Anyway, people, who think he could have turned you anything, are dumbasses you don't need to spend your time on, and people who think it should have been on you to ensure the continued friendship between your ex and his friends are ridiculous. So much not the asshole. Not the asshole he sounds fragile. Edit, both he and his friends are fragile. I was about to say you're the asshole because a divorce is a long story, and if you are on good terms, coming out publicly with something like that right after the divorce is final could make you look bad. However, not the asshole, because the reasons he is mad are all about him. I could understand if he were hurt if your coming out was the first he had heard of your orientation. However, he is angry because of what people will think of him. What a selfish dick. OMG, he gave you the gay. Seriously, not the asshole. Being true to yourself is not a reflection on him. Not the asshole. Your ex should tell his friends, no, she was always a lesbian but was either afraid to come out or did not know it. I am glad she finally accepted who she is. Generally using empathy and kindness instead of acting defensive or embarrassed makes it hard for people bully, joke, or otherwise make fun of something. And he should, and probably does, honestly feel happy for you even if he is a bit hurt which is also understandable. Info. Did you tell your ex about your sexuality before you broke up? This could be a knee-jerk to his feeling betrayed by the revelation. Even if you didn't tell him, this is probably a nah, but it's something I would have discussed with my partner before a breakup occurred. People will think he turned me into a lesbian, sigh. It's 2020, you'd think by now people would know this isn't how sexuality works. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Tell him to call his friends out on their homophobic comments or to ditch them if they are so upsetting. Live your life. Nah, it seems like there's hurt people on both sides and that neither side is purposefully hurting the other. You made the best choice for yourself and I'm sure that your ex is just in a place of confusion and uncertainty with himself. His friends really are the asshole here. They should be there to support him. Not the asshole, I mean the only girl I ever had a crush on was in middle school and she rejected me more times than I can count. A year later I came out as gay and to this day she thinks she turned me gay. It's not your fault that your ex and his friends choose not to understand how sexual orientation works and that you can't just turn someone gay. 
you clearly didn't find the fulfillment in that relationship that you needed and once you were free from the constraints of that, you were able to figure out what makes you happy. That's all that matters. Not the asshole. your coming out moment is very personal and the only person's feelings you should have to consider as a single person going through this are your own. I do understand your ex-husband's situation even if I don't think that he's justified in feeling slighted. There will be jokes centered around his adequacy as a man made at his expense because that's just how our stupid, gendered, toxic masculinity works in today's society and that does suck. But that's not on you and you're not responsible for his personal development as he navigates the process of becoming a better person.